What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to manually install your Wildstar add-ons without things like the Curse Client or Mission Control. You got to know how to download and install these things manually because sometimes the Curse Client doesn't work after a major update or whatever your installation method that's not manual might be, it just might not work sometimes. So here's how you do it manually if you don't want to deal with programs like that. So get to where you downloaded your add-on, uh, probably the downloads folder I would assume. And uh, I downloaded the mod Trackmaster. I've never used it before, so hopefully I can configure it right. But I'm going to click on Trackmaster, going to extract it to the Downloads folder. Ba boom Now Trackmaster is in the Downloads folder. This is where a lot of people mess up. So when you are copying this folder, you need to go one folder deep. This first folder is completely worthless. You want to click one folder in and copy this folder. Same thing goes with these other mods, like Runecrafting Fix. Well, actually, no, not Runecrafting. But some of the mods, you just gotta, you gotta be careful because some of the mods, this first folder is just complete bullshit. So you gotta copy the second folder in for some of the some mods. Uh, for this mod in particular, you do. So copy that, and uh, then we're gonna go to the uh, the search right here and type in percentage app data percentage and that is going to bring us to the roaming folder now I know some of you guys have probably tried to go in and find the add-ons folder very similarly to like what you did with WoW where you go to the interface enter add-ons whatever and uh, it doesn't work because the app data and roaming folders are hidden I, I don't know what the deal is I'm not a computer genius but I, I couldn't find them without specifically typing in what I needed to, to get to, to to see them so uh, that's the best way I know to do it. percentage app data percentage and click on the roaming and this is going to bring you to all of your app data files, uh, folders for every single program you've got. Going to hit in, click something, hit in, go to NCSoft. And this is going to bring you to your Wildstar folder, your Wildstar add-ons folder. Wildstar add-ons. And there you go. These are all the mods I have. And real simple, just going to hit copy paste. Trackmaster is now in there. And I have not logged out of the game, I'm still in the game, all I gotta do is slash reload UI, and hopefully, unless I'm a dumbass, uh, it should be in here now, let's take a look. Track master, I might have to force it to load, I'm not sure if it's, with this, if it works with this API, track master, track master, track, there it is, track master. So now this mod is in there. I have no idea how to configure it, or, or maybe if I just click on a target, it'll, uh, well, fuck. Uh, oh, oh, here we go, here we go, it's right here. Track. Track, mailbox, What? yeah, there we go, see, now it's working. I've never used this mod before, but, uh, I guess this mod, this is actually a pretty damn cool mod. So you can click on a target and hit track. Ooh, that's actually pretty fucking neat. Wow. Check out the mod track master, that was unintended, I just picked a random mod off curse. So... Yeah, that's actually really cool. Anyway, uh, that's how you download and install your mods on Wildstar. Uh, yeah, figured you guys would want to know how to do it manually. I know some of you guys don't want any extra programs you don't need, so have fun with that. I, Yeah, that's it. See you next time.